What's good, YouTube? It's your boy, Bird. You know, we back on Bird's That View with it. Like always, appreciate your love and support. Please continue to like, comment, and subscribe. Stop what you're doing. Smash the like button. Smash subscribe button. Hop in the comment section. Comment whatever you want. Of course, I'm dropping daily bangers day by day. You know we got news of the day coming out of Colorado, and we're just going to jump right into it. So, of course, this Colorado football program took care of business against the rival Nebraska Cornhuskers. Started off a little slow. Offense picked it up late. Defense played really, really well today. Of course, I will be in Boulder, Colorado this upcoming Saturday. I know college game day is going to be there, so I will be there as well. I have some bird's eye view gear on. If you see me, make sure you show some love. Come holler at me. I can't wait to see some of you all in person. But yes, I will be in Boulder, Colorado. Let's jump into it. Got an inside handoff to number 22. Defense came to play today. They really, really showed out. Of course, Nebraska is a known running team, especially with Sims. As you see, Cam and Sims and Craig, he played well today as well. He ended up getting the start because Miles Slusher was out. Got Sims back at quarterback. He's going to complete a pass to Billy Kemp. He's going to make Shallow Sanders miss. He's going to get up field. Shallow is going to get back in the picture and make the tackle there. We can keep this train rolling here. Got an inside run there. Tackled by Jordan Dominic, number 44. He put on an absolute show today. Uh, keep it rolling. Got another inside handoff that was stopped in the backfield there. Like I said, defense swarm all game. They definitely played a lot better. I believe that was a fumble recovery there. I know Nebraska had trouble fumbling the football. We'll keep rolling. We got Shador Sanders back at quarterback. He's going to play the pass over the middle to Jimmy Horn Jr. for a first down. Shador still back at quarterback. He's going to roll out to his right. Doesn't see anybody. Slides down. I thought it was a late hit there on the quarterback. I know Savion Washington came in and defended his quarterback. It was a little flop there by number four. Ended up getting the penalty. Shador still back at quarterback. Stepping up in the pocket. Rolling out to his right. And he is going to complete a pass to Xavier Weaver. What a day he had as well. Rolling out to his left. Complete a pass to Travis Hunter. Great throw and great catch there by that dynamic duo. Shador Sanders still back. At quarterback, he's going to step up in the pocket. He's going to take off. And he's going to run and he's going to slide down for a positive yardage. The drive is going to stall there, though. Uh, Nebraska back on offense. Great play there by number 25, Ham at linebacker. He played phenomenal as well. Sims still back at quarterback. He's going to complete a pass to number one, Billy Kemp. He's going to be slowed up slightly by Shiloh Sanders and then finished off by Carter Stockmount, number 23. Shadur back at quarterback. He's going to get sacked. They did give up a lot of sacks. Of course, we're going to want to clean that up. Got an inside handoff to Gabe Irvin, number 22. He's going to break a couple tackles for a positive game. He actually played pretty well. Uh, we're going to keep it rolling. We got Sims still back at quarterback. And we have another play by Jordan Dominic flying off the edge. Of course, we have third down here. And of course, the defense is going to stall again. Great play by the defense. They played extremely well today. And of course, we have a field goal here, and that's going to go off the uprights. That is no good defense with another stall drive. Of course, the Buffalo's faithful are definitely going to enjoy that. Uh, we got an inside handoff. That is Cavassier Smoke for a minimal gain drive stall there. Of course, like I said, it was, they were dropping the football. Sims, for whatever reason, could not get control of the snap. And of course, we have another turnover by this Colorado Buffalo's defense setting us up with great field position. Got a pass completed out to number six to Vars Dawson for another positive gain. Shadur still back at quarterback. He's going to try to complete a pass to Dylan Edwards. He is going to be broken up by Omar Brown, number 12. Of course, Jace Philly out to attempt the field goal, and it is good. He is always money. We're going to keep it rolling. Got an inside handoff. Great play again by Jordan Dominic. Again, that young man is a dog. He's been that guy. He really showed it yesterday. Keep it rolling. Sims back at quarterback. He's going to try to complete a pass, but that is going to be picked off by number seven, Cam Silman Craig. Great play by that young man. Again, Cam got the start. Miles Slusher is out for a couple weeks, so Cam got the start, and he's been that guy as well. Of course, another Jackson State transfer. He's been playing with Coach Prime since high school. That young man can really play football. He's all over the football field. Great play. Great first turnover for Cam Silman Craig. Of course, we'll keep it rolling right off the turnover. Shadur Sanders is going to hit Tavares Dawson the four-star transfer wide receiver for his first Colorado Buffaloes touchdown. Of course, we're going to hear his name get called later on as well. We can keep it rolling. Got Jeff Sims back at quarterback. He's going to handle a low snap, and we have a sack that looks like Leonard Payne and Taj Austin as well, number 49 and number 55 on the play. Shador back at quarterback. Savion Washington in the backfield. We have a pass completed. That is Travis Hunter. He's going to make two guys run into each other in midfield. Travis Hunter is him. Everyone knows that. Shadur is still back at quarterback. He's going to complete a pass to Xavier Weaver. Of course, he's going to get upfield for another Buffalo's first down. He put on a great show as well. Complete a pass to Jimmy Horn 
for more positive yardage. So many explosive weapons on this Colorado Buffalo's offense. Shadur drops back. He's scanning the field. Uh, he's going to move forward and he's going to complete a pass that is out to Savion Wilkerson for a minimal gain there. Of course, we have another field goal attempt here by Jace Philly. And this is money without question. Anytime you have to line up, especially inside the 40, you might as well just go ahead and put three points on the board. We have halftime here. 13-0 score. Buffaloes are up and we get the ball back to start the half. Shadur is going to get sacked. Of course, we got to clean it up. I believe, believe he was sacked about seven times on Saturday. Shadur is still back at quarterback. Plenty of time here. He's going to make one guy miss. He's going to get upfield and he's going to complete a pass. So guess who? Travis Hunter. Great pitch and catch for that dynamic duo there. We have a Buffaloes first down. We're going to keep it rolling. We got a pass completed to DeVars Dawson. One of four catches, I believe, for him on the day. Jimmy Horn going in motion. We tried to jet sweep on fourth down. I believe it was fourth and five, and we did not get that. Drive stall. Sims back at quarterback. He's going to step up, and again, he's going to get sacked again. Taj Austin, the West Virginia transfer, is there on the play. He was one of the guys that I was really high on coming into this season. Great play by that young man. Sims still back at quarterback. He's going to motion it back out to the left, which took the linebacker away, and he's going to do what he does best. He is going to take that ball all the way to the end zone for a touchdown by Jeff Sims there. I believe it was about 57-yard touchdown. Of course, Coach Sean Lewis can get the offense back on the field rolling. Got a handoff to Anthony Hankerson, number nine, for a tough run. Anthony Hankerson still back in the backfield. Shadur Sanders is going to complete a pass. Uh, I believe that was Xavier Weaver, one of his 10 catches on the day. Shadur still back at quarterback. He's going to throw a bomb downfield to guess who? That is Xavier Weaver for another big play by that young man. Uh, looks like we have an inside handoff to Anthony Hankerson. He's going to make a great cut and get upfield for about a gain of six yards. Shadur is going to complete a pass. That is Anthony Hankerson again. He played well as well. Should, uh, that's a, like Dylan Edwards with a great block right there, which allowed Shadur Sanders to have time to hit Xavier Weaver for a Colorado Buffaloes touchdown. That young man, you might as well just go ahead and sketch his name in the senior bowl. He's a stud. Sims back at quarterback. He's going to complete a pass, and that is going to be tackled immediately by Shiloh Sanders. Of course, the Buffaloes are back on offense. Uh, I believe Shadur's arm was hit there. The ball fluttered in the air. Dylan Edwards, Johnny on the spot, was able to catch that football and get upfield. Shadur's still back at quarterback. He's going to hand the ball off to guess who? The speedster, four-star true freshman running back Dylan Edwards for a huge gain and another Buffalo's first down. Shadur's going to complete a pass to Xavier Weaver. He's going to get upfield. We have another Buffalo's first down. Of course, the offense picked it up in the second half here. Uh, Shadur back at quarterback, and he's going to look upfield. And he's going to end up getting sacked. Of course, like I said, that was about one of seven sacks that we had drive stalled there. We got Nebraska back on offense. Jeff Sims doing what he does best, breaking a run. QB draw there for a first down. He's going to fake a handoff to number 22, Gabe Irvin. He's going to look upfield. He's going to turn to his left. Of course, he's going to complete a pass to number 87, Nate Borkacher, for a first down for this Nebraska's offense. Of course, now we're in the fourth quarter. As you see, you got Terrell Owens. We had a lot of celebrities on hand. Of course, no one wants to miss the home opener. Michael Irvin, of course, the Hall of Famer, was in attendance as well. We just love the support that we're getting for this Colorado Buffaloes program. We got an uh, inside handoff. It was supposed to be a handoff. Fumbled. Sims didn't get close enough to the running back. He didn't put it in his gut. And of course, that is another turn turnover for this Buffalo's defense, a defense that gave up a lot of yards and a lot of points last week, came in playing with a chip on their shoulder, and they definitely played extremely well. Bishop Thomas was there to recover the fumble. Great play by that young man. Of course, he's going to let the world know that he's been a dog without question. Shador back at quarterback. He is going to complete a pass. That is out to, looks like Xavier Weaver again for another catch there. Keep it rolling. Shador still back at quarterback. He's going to complete a pass out two looks like jimmy horn jr for another great first down by this colorado offense we just love the production that we were seeing especially in the second half got another pass completed out to xavier weaver for more positive yardage should do it still back at quarterback he's going to hand the ball off that looks like anthony hankerson there for another great run by that young man uh, should do it still back at quarterback he's going to fake a handoff there he's going to roll out to his left set up a screen travis hunter blocking downfield jimmy horn jr is going to get upfield for another positive yardage we're inside the 10 at this point love this play here coach sean lewis got in his bag great play design we got a reverse to the speedster tavares dawson great pancake block at the goal line by right tackle savion washington that is the second touchdown one receiving one rushing for that four star four three speedster coming out of the auburn uh looks like of course we're gonna go for two here 
And we all know ultimately this did not count, but what a hell of a play that was by Shadur Sanders, eluding would-be tacklers left and right, still keeping his eyes downfield and completing the pass to Anthony Hankerson. Of course, replay overturned it, but it was still a great effort. We're back on defense. Sims back at quarterback. Of course, he's going to take off and run. And Shiloh Sanders is going to be Johnny on the spot with the tackle there, getting chased out of the pocket by Savelle Smalls. He kind of rolled up on him a little bit there. I know his ankle kind of got caught underneath uh, Savelle Smalls. Of course, we're, you know, we don't ever want to see anyone hurt regardless if it's the rival. So of course, speedy recovery for Jeff Sims without question. Looks like we got number 10 back at quarterback. That's Heinrich Harburg. He's going to run around the right side and he's going to get tackled. Uh, by a host of Colorado Buffaloes who can keep it rolling. Got an inside handoff to number 22, Gabe Irvin. He's going to be tackled in the backfield for a minimal gain there. Of course, we got Jordan Dominic getting pressure. That was Levante Bentley, the Clemson transfer, with the big hit on the quarterback there. And of course, we're back on offense. Shadur Sanders is going to complete a pass to guess who? Xavier Weaver on a screen pass. He's going to make a few guys miss in open space. He's still on his feet. He's going to get down to about the 10 yard line. He put on an absolute show. I'm telling you right now, Xavier Weaver is a pro. He is that guy. Of course, we'll keep it rolling. Got Shadur still back at quarterback. He's going to scan the field, see something that he doesn't like. He's going to roll out to his right, keep his eyes downfield, and he's going to complete a pass to number 87 tight end, Michael Harrison, for another Buffaloes first down. We are now inside the 10 yard line. Shador is going to roll out, see something he doesn't like. He's going to tuck the football away and he's going to get into the end zone for a touchdown. And it's only right that he hit Coach Prime's dance when he got into the end zone. What a great performance by Shador Sanders. He is a legit Heisman Trophy candidate. We love that sign there <laughs> for sure. That was a great sign. Of course, you see Nebraska faithful. Where y'all going? Y'all had a whole lot to say. Them boy leaving early. Terrible. Of course, uh, looks like we have an inside handoff there, and that was tackled in the backfield for a minimal gain there. Uh, of course, we got another inside handoff here that is going to be stopped short for another minimal gain. Defense came to play without question here. Of course, uh, looks like we got Charlie in the backfield. We got the twos on the field now. Ryan Staub is back at quarterback. We got number 44 running back Charlie. Of course, the walk-on sensation that everyone has been extremely high on on camp. And of course, the Buffaloes close it out. As you see, the students could not wait to rush the field. Congratulations to all the Colorado football faithful, everyone that's involved with this program. Big shout out to Well Off Media always. I will be in Boulder for college game day this Saturday. Come holler at me. Please continue to like, comment, and subscribe. You know what time it is, though. Birds eye view.